I'm Star Roberts Mathern, historic photojournalist, writer, actress, and classical singer. I have always been drawn to antique things um, and basically everything historic. Yeah, I started shooting in Donaldsonville originally. I started po posting on social media and basically the pictures just started getting noticed and I started getting opportunities rolling in to do historic work and get paid for what I do. My primary clients um, are basically plantation homes, um, bed and breakfast, um, all historic. Um, from city to city, there could be businesses within a historic district um, that I go into that need uh, publication, um, they need advertisement. So basically, I'll take their pictures, um, I'll do official interviews with them, um, I put together marketing packages um, for each client. And I also do individual work as well. So if anyone has an historic home that they need captured um, and they need that history preserved through photos and through journalism, I do that as well. A girl from San Jose living in the Baton Rouge area since childhood, Starr decided to use historic Donaldsonville as her muse, citing the architecture and strong sense of community as her inspiration. The people here. The people are just remarkable. They have such a deep appreciation and love for their city. Um, they all tell me uh, many stories about the history that resides here. And it's just an amazing city to be in. She managed to strike up a few conversations during filming, as everyone recognized her. I mean, the community loves you. And I love them. <laughs> Though she's based in Donaldsonville, Star's work has gained traction in the most unlikely city, New York. While on her honeymoon in the summer of 2017, she took photos of the many buildings in America's largest city and posted them on social media. From there, um, I received several business opportunities from New York City to return to capture several of their beautiful landmarks. I am writing a book um, called A Daughter's Journey, Dave Bankin and the Map. The book is about my real father. When I was six months old in San Jose, California, uh, my birthplace, my mom had, um, had left out of that marriage and we ended up here in Louisiana and so I had never got to meet my father. Dave Vacant, real name David Scott Roberts, was a Bay Area punk rocker in the 1970s and 80s. She had been trying to find him ever since childhood. I had come to find out that I was unable to find him all of these years because he had a stage name. So basically I was looking for him by his real name of David Scott Roberts. Upon learning of his residence in Portland, Oregon, Star learned that her birth father passed away April 15, 2010. Since then, um, a Facebook group called In Memoriam, the Friends of the Mab and Beyond, um, had ended up reaching out to me about my real father. They had provided me with the most um, heartfelt and amazing stories. In light of her book coming out, she'll be traveling to California, where Dave Vacant's friends will throw a tribute concert. Star also plans to do a book signing, an opportunity to meet everyone in the Facebook group. It's in pre-publication stages, set to come out in the near future. Um, and there is a movie opportunity based on the book coming as well. What the arts mean to me is creativity and pouring that creativity out onto others. And within my historic photojournalism, uh, my goal with that moving forward is to promote tourism within each city that I visit and to tell the stories of others. Everyone has a story to be told and heard. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, and I have a new website that's under construction. And you can also email me at stardustroberts at gmail.com. I'm Star Roberts Mathern. And this is my scene TV.